Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear viewers, we are going for the next part for our building design in Prota Structure 2019. In last tutorial, we have modeled up to level five. Now we will go for level six to level fifteen. Then this lift roof. Now what we will do we will go to story insert story from here now here is story 6 at level 5 so at level 15 story should be 16 and lift headroom so total will be 17 now we will go to story 7 that means level 6 here we will replicate story 6 elements so select, select this one then right click on story then generate story from 7 to 16 shift 16 or we can go up to 17 then we will delete the extra portion keeping the lift head or lift roof portion so shift select now click on ok now close this one this replicated up to story 17 that means level 16 level 16 for stair head now we will start from history 7 from here we will go up to history 17 one by one now in history 7 that means level 6 the column is inclined we will check the distance from this point to this point 0.25 meter that means 250 millimeter from here to here 250 millimeter so increasing this horizontal distance 250 millimeter in each floor up to level 15 that means here story 16 here we will draw offset axis press f2 250 enter uh, this is coming right side so what we will do we will provide f2 minus 250 enter then same same way we will draw for other floors okay now this one 14 now we will move columns and structural member from grid 4 to 14 at story 7 because story 7 that means level 6 at level 6 the column top will be at grid 14 or x is 14 and uh, from bottom of this column will be at x is 4 that means this axis so we have to move this one move select the axis this move select the axis this is the way of move, moving column right click right click move then select the axis where you want to move right click move select the axis and this move select the axis for moving beam select the beam move you have to choose select the starting point 
to this one so beam will be moved so this for moving beam we have to follow this procedure now we can redraw our this slab and beams select press delete and mark axis click on ok select beam from here to here and now draw slab load as well as previous one ok now if we want to copy the wall load we can select we can select copy beam wall load and select the beam paste copied beam wall load now we will move bottom of this column to grid or axis 4 so now select this column then right click properties this select this arrow pick bottom insertion point then select the grid then update now we can see the column has been updated and it is showing as it is inclined same way select this one properties then update right click properties click on insertion point bottom select the axis update property bottom select update properties select this update properties bottom this update now we can see here the column is in inclined position now we can go to next floor story 8 here we will move these columns and beams to axis 15 select this one move click axis move move
so this done now we will delete this portion then draw beam then draw slab like this copy beam overload paste like this okay here we are considering there is no wall now this column properties bottom select 14 axis update like this this one properties bottom choose this one object Okay, now we can see here the column is inclining in the proper way. Okay, now in the same way we will go to next plots and we will move columns same way as I have shown. Now go to history 9 then select move this one here we can see when we cannot see the grid here it is showing the grid number in small letter and yellow color 15 16 17 this is great feature for this proto structure software we cannot see the grid here to move any element in the proper grid number they are showing the grid in small letter or small font here also now here move up to this 16 like this So in this way we have finished up to this level 15 here in history 16 we will go to 17 we will delete this portion only we will keep share all or lift core Here left curve we will 
white slab here lift sl roof slab and now here we will edit our wall load at level 16 delete b one load yes now here we will edit b one load here wall height we will change 1.2 meter ok now copy beam wall load then select the periphery beams paste yes now done this load we will delete So now our model is ready. In the next tutorial, we will apply wind load and seismic load for this structure. Then we will go for analysis and design. So till then, stay tuned with Decode BD and press like button if you like the tutorial. If you have not subscribed the channel yet, subscribe to get more updates on different software. Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.